Both are zero tailpipe emission electric vehicles, but they move energy differently, and that shapes efficiency, cost, and convenience. How they work. Battery EVs. Charge a battery from the grid, then power a motor few conversions, high efficiency. Fuel cell EVs. Make, compress, and deliver hydrogen, then convert it back to electricity on board more steps, lower efficiency. Range, refueling, hydrogen. Three five minute fills, strong highway range. EVs. Fast charge 10, 80% in, 20, 40 minutes. Home charging adds overnight convenience, energy, cost. EVs use far less electricity per kilometers and cost less per mile, especially on off-peak home rates. Hydrogen is energy intensive to produce. Stations are costly to build and run. Infrastructure. Chargers are widespread and growing. Hydrogen stations remain scarce outside a few hubs. Cold, towing, uptime. Fuel cells keep steady refueling times. EV range can drop in cold or under heavy loads, though heat pumps, preconditioning, and larger packs help. Environment. EVs are as clean as the power mix. Hydrogen can be near act zero if made from renewables, but much supply today isn't. Best fit. EVs. Daily driving. Cities. Most households. Hydrogen. Fleet duty cycles needing fast turns, long routes, or centralized depots. Bottom line. EVs lead for efficiency, running cost, and available infrastructure. Hydrogen suits specific use cases where fast refueling and uptime dominate. 